Hey guys, a lot of you asked how I did the vampire voice. Um, I did that in Audacity, and I'm going to show you how I did it. And um, I'll just let you know what I'm kind of up to. I'm working on this Vampire Tales. If you haven't seen the video that promos it, um, check it out. I just uploaded it 20 minutes ago, maybe. Um, this vampire, me, is going to be narrating stories. And, um, yeah. So that's pretty much what I'm up to lately. A lot of work that has to go into that. And um, I'm doing that on my blue screen, so you probably recognize. Eh, I know, blue screen. Um, yeah, so. Yeah. Let's take you into Audacity and show you how to do pitch shift. And how I did the band. <laughs> I believe I did E. That's too close to my normal voice. E D, I believe. This is about where I did it. So I changed to the pitch and I just brought the pitch down. And there it was. So that's how you then you would just export those wave and you would save it into the file format. So that's how you do the vampire voice. Good luck. And you can use that to also do the chipmunk voice. You just bring the audio file up instead of down. I did that same technique in this video here. For more of my videos, check out Chrome JT, uh, MHC Productions, and see you later.